are trying to win $25,000. Every one of them holds a different riddle, but only one of them holds the jackpot riddle. You never know when someone in the game will stand up and yell, jackpot! Ladies and gentlemen, your host is Jeff Edwards. All righty. Thank you, Lynn. Hi, everybody. Hi, Lynn. Welcome to Jackpot. These 16 players are with us all this week, and they know that the answer to just one riddle can be worth $25,000. Now, when time ran out uh, yesterday, Jackpot was at $570. Lee is our king of the hill. Uh, Lee, you're a hospital volunteer, right? Yes, I am. All right. Now, let me show you the interesting position you're in. We know that Alan has the Jackpot riddle. Okay? You could go for it right now and solve it, and uh, if you did, just put the money in the Jackpot with uh, Alan. But let me show you. Our jackpot number is approaching the target number. If it matches the target number, you'll have a chance at $13,000. There's certainly uh, enough riddles up there to, uh, to make that combination. We'll see if that happens, if you want to go on. Right. If you go on to build it up and head to that target number, it'll be at your own risk. What do you want to do? I'm going on, Jeff. Good for you, and good luck, Lee. Here we go. Number 10. Number 10. Okay, Lee. For $165, this is my riddle. I'm the rear-end message on the car up front. What am I called? Bumper sticker. Right you are, Lee. Okay. A $70 riddle would do it if one is up there. Three. $70? For $100. Oh. This is my riddle. I come before hook and kangaroo. What's my rank? I come before hook and kangaroo. What's my rank? Oh, dear. Captain Kangaroo and Captain oh, Hook. Remember yes, Captain Hook? Yes, course. and Peter Pan. All right, come on down, Beth. You stumped her. <laughs> Beth, $735 in the jackpot. Still looking for a $70 riddle. Might be one there. We have uh, five players up there. Continue to build it up if you want, or you can shoot right for Alan and try to solve it now. What do you want to do? Once again, I might be crazy, but I'm going to try and build it up. <laughs> Good for you. I hope you're not crazy. Let's see what happens. Number nine. Number okay. nine, Sonia. For $120, this is my riddle. I'm the part of your bathroom floor you'll find on a Scrabble board. What am I? Right. Tile. Tile is right. Yes, indeed. For $120. Now what? 13. Good luck, Beth. Okay, Sherry, what do you have? For $145, this is my riddle. I'm the group of cows that listens. What am I? You're the herd. Herd is right. Good for you, Beth. $990 in the jackpot. Alan has it over there. Number five. What are you going to do? Keep going? Number 11. Number 11. Oh, all right. Good for luck. $135, this is my riddle. I'm the kind of drawers you keep in your drawers. <laughs> what am I called? I'm the kind of drawers you keep in your drawers. What am I called? You're short. Yeah, that's right. Shorts is right. Underpants, underwear, whatever. Well, you're building up nicely at $1,135. Don't forget you're at risk every time you go. Okay, let's do the jackpot. I didn't want to talk into it, but uh, that's probably a good idea. Alan? All right, all the best to you, Beth. All right, this is jackpot riddle. He'll read it, and I'll repeat it. I'm what you do to a beard, a baby, or a violin. What am I? And what you do to a beard, a baby, or a violin. For $1,135, what am I? Oh, you stroke a beard, you stroke a baby, and you stroke a violin. Oh. Beth, too bad. Come on down here, Alan. You're going to take over a nice jackpot. <laughs> We're going to go for the red wallets now, please. Those will have your riddles for the next game. And, uh, Alan, here you are again. Yeah, I'm back right. again. Nice to see you here again. Let's get a target number for you here. Brand new game. Target number is 710. All righty. And a super jackpot, let's take a look and see what that's going to be. Every time the last three digits of your jackpot match the target number, you'll be going for a super jackpot with $16,500. Okay, Alan, who are you going to start with? We're going to start with number four. Number okay, four. Good luck. Thanks. For Royal Dulton, did I say? China, sure, worth $680. This is my riddle. I'm the one thing the Chinese can always count on. What am I? I mean, the one thing the Chinese can always count on for a set of Royal Dalton China worth $680. What am I? Yen? 
<laughs> Wrong country. No. <laughs> they count on an abacus. abacus. Yeah, an abacus. That's okay, Alan. We're going to bring you down here. At least I say it's okay. Chris is going back up. All right, Chris. Nice jackpot. Yeah, $1,135. I'm going to go for the jackpot. No, we don't have the jackpot. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, we would love to have you do that, but that's a different game. Okay, you go. Sorry. It's there it's someplace. It's somebody else there someplace. Okay. Oh, okay, number 12. Number Please. 12. For $130, this is my riddle. I'm the mass character that catches speeding drivers. Who am I? The mass character catches speeding drivers. Who am I? The policeman. No, remember Mash, the television show Radar uh, was oh, on Mash. That's the catch of speeding drivers. Come on down here, Donna. <laughs> and that's the way the game goes. King of the Hill. Donna's King of the Hill right now, and uh, a lot of players up there. Okay, number eight, please. Looking for the jackpot rhythm. Good luck. Jackpot! All right, there. No. Now, again, decision time. It's a nice jackpot, $1,135. You can go right now to solve it and split that with Jane if you got it right. Or you can continue to build it up. Uh, target number certainly within reach. There's a prize uh, riddle up there someplace. What do you want to do? I have to try to guess, Jane. My, my batting average hasn't been too good today. So you're going for the jackpot? I am. All right, this is a jackpot riddle. Jane will read it. I'll repeat it, and good luck to both of you. Go, Donna. A customer gives me, a waiter takes me, and a judge calls for me. What word am I? A customer gives me, a waiter takes me, and a judge calls for me. What word am I for $1,135? Is it a tip? No, no. I suppose the judge might... Uh, no, the judge doesn't call for tips. Order. Oh, Customer gives an order. Wow. Waiter takes an order. Judge calls for order. We're going to go for a commercial as Jane comes down here and takes over the king of the old spot. We are on jackpot. Well, the bad news, Jane, you didn't get to split that jackpot, but the good news is you're king of the hill. We're building up a nice jackpot for you, $1,135. Let's get your target number and see what we're going to be dealing with in this game. All right, 500. And uh, remember, any time the last three digits of the jackpot match that target number, you'll be going for a super jackpot in this game worth $11,000. Okay, Jane, where are you going to go? 14. Number 14. Great. For $130, this is my riddle. I can get called by an umpire or a labor union. What am I? Strike. Strike is right. Good for you. One. Number one. Okay. Colleen. For 135 this is my riddle. My job involves lots of rewrites, and it's the same job as Perry White. What's my occupation? Editor. Right. Editor is right. Now, hold on a second. We're going to take a look at that target number. $1,400. you are $100 away from matching that uh, target number. Should you match it, you'll have a chance at $11,000. And, Jane, there's a bunch of players up there, but one of them has a $100 riddle. Kevin, you got 100 Number 11. For 170 oh. Oh. This is my riddle. I can describe an egg, a seed, or blood, and none of it is good. What word am I? Bad. Bad is right. Bad blood, bad seed, and uh, bad egg. Three. Number three. Now we're looking for that jackpot riddle. Lee. For $150, this is my riddle. I can be a baby carriage or a leisurely walker. What am I called? You are a stroller. You are right, James. Yeah, you're going great. I might tell you right now uh, that if you did 15 players uh, in a row, got 15 riddles right, you, we'd add another $1,000 to that jackpot. So something to shoot for here. Thank you, Jeff. Number you four. <laughs> okay, Alan. For a week's vacation at Murrieta Hot Springs Resort worth $1,455. This is my riddle. I'm the kind of moth that wears an earring and tells fortunes. What kind of moth am I? A gypsy moth! Right you are. You got a vacation really at a hot spring. Congratulations. Oh, you're doing great, Jane. Two. Number two, Kathy. Jackpot! There it is. It's jackpot with it. Nice fat jackpot, $1,720. You can go for it now, put it with Kathy. Or you might want to try to build it up. Bunch of players left. What do you think? Kathy? Go I don't blame you. You're going for the luck. jackpot. I hope you get it. I can be soft or as cold as can be, and sometimes I have a tip on me. 
What am I? This is a jackpot riddle. I can be soft or as cold as can be, and sometimes I have a chip on me. For $1,720, what am I? A shoulder! You got the money. <laughs> All right, James, we'll put you back up there. And uh, Kathy will go up there. Let me pick up her name tag. and just, You can have that in your Zubert. Kind of missed that thing. We're going to have a brand new game. And what are we going to do? We're going to go for the gray wallets, everybody. Pick up the gray wallets. That'll start off our next game. Kathy, how you feel? Oh, Friday's my lucky day. Yeah, that was fun, wasn't it? All right, let's see what we're going to do as a target number for you in this game. Target number... 640. And if jackpot matches that target number, you're going to be going for a super jackpot worth $14,500. Okay, number four. Number four. Oh, hi, oh. Congratulations. Oh, you're good. The announcer. <laughs> jackpot. Oh. <laughs> well, I don't think you have much of a choice here. No, uh, nothing to split. So let's okay. build it up and see where we go. Number six. For a compact disc changer worth $519, this is my riddle. I'm the blonde who's turned my success into a real dynasty. What actress am I? Linda Evans? Yes, good for you. So you got the uh, disc changer, and you can add that to your dowry for your wedding coming yeah. up soon, I guess. And now what? Uh, let's go for number eight. Number eight. Here we go. For $125, this is my riddle. I'm the TV miniseries that could have been called The Breezes of Battle. What's my real title? The Winds of War. Yeah, good for you. Here's some money with Jackpot. Now, we know where the Jackpot riddle. Alan has it. Only $125 in there. What are you going to do? Number 13. Building it up. Good Kathy. luck. For $120, this is my riddle. I make sure Fido keeps his big mouth shut. What object am I? Uh, your muzzle. Yes, good for you. Doing great. Remember, Kathy, uh, just to throw another thing uh, in, into, your, uh, into your mind there, if you did all 15 riddles in a row, got them correctly, a $1,000 bonus for you. Number 10. Number 10. <laughs> okay, Kathy. For $165, this is my riddle. I'm as common as dirt and often dry as can be, but what would a sculptor do without me? What am I? I'm as common as dirt and often dry as can be, but what would a sculptor do without me? What am I? Are you Clay? Yes, you are Clay. Good for you. All right, Kathy, we're going to take a break. We'll leave you right there. We'll be back in just a couple minutes on Jackpot. Don't go away. Ah, uh, we're back. Kathy, nice to study because she knows Alan has a Jackpot riddle. Uh, Kathy, if you look, we're approaching that target number. Match the target number with the jackpot. Should be worth $14,500. You can solve the jackpot if you want now or try to, or keep going and build it up. I'm, we'll keep going. Sure, don't Let's blame Let's go me. for number 12. Number 12. Good luck, Kathy. For $100, here's my riddle. If I'm not the last word, you haven't got a prayer. What word am I? Amen. Amen. That's right. We're looking for a $130 riddle to match that target number. And if you could do that, it would be worth $14,500. And, Kathy, there is a $130 riddle there. Let's go for number one. Looking for $130, Colleen. $140. Too <laughs> bad. You can find me in front of Domino and after Minnesota. What word am I? Uh, you can find me in front of Domino and after Minnesota. What word am I? <laughs> On Blueberry Hill, Fats Domino. Oh, yes, no. Minnesota Fats, the guy who plays the pool. And we changed right now. Colleen coming down. <laughs> Colleen, guess what? Guess what? That $100, uh, $130 riddle is still there worth $14,500 if you match the target number. Oh, my God. Um... Seven. Lucky seven. $130, on, George. Be there, buddy. Be there. For $160, this is my riddle. I'm what the stallion used to figure, to figure out a problem. What am I? I'm what the stallion used to figure out a problem. What am I? The stallion. A distance? No. Horse sense. 
course sense. Come on down, George. Once again. Hurry up, George. We got seven players left. Even though where we know where the jackpot riddle is, a $130 riddle there. You find that one and you are on your way. Number 11. Number 11. $130. For $155. Oh, oh. This is my riddle. All my children call me Mama Mia. Who am I? Mama Celeste. <laughs> Mia Farrow. Mama Mia. She's got a whole bunch of children. Come on down, Kevin. One way or the other. We are whittling down the odds. Once again, we know where the jackpot riddle is, but one of those six players has a riddle with $130, which would, if you could solve it, match the target number. I'm going to try number nine. Number nine. God be with us. For $130. That's it! All right. Now, let me tell you what we're going to do here. You have found the riddle. You solve that riddle, and then the jackpot and the target number will match, and you're going to be playing for a super jackpot worth $14,500. Okay. Good luck. Good luck. <laughs> My riddle is, if you don't want your pants, around your knees, let me and my buckle give your waist a squeeze. What am I? You're a belt. You are right, Kevin. <laughs> Look at the numbers roll up. The jackpot number matches the target number. And you are going for $14,500. Okay, I have the super jackpot riddle right here. This is just a little bit different because either one of you can answer this riddle, but I can only accept one answer, and that'll be from the first person who speaks up. I'm going to read it once, then I'll repeat it. Then you have five seconds to answer. Good luck. For $14,500, this is the super jackpot riddle. I'm hard on the outside, precious on the inside, and I spend most of my time in bed. I'll read it one more time. I'm hard on the outside, precious on the inside, and I spend most of my time in bed for $14,500. What am I? You're an oyster. You've got $14,500! Oh. Oh. Congratulations! $14,500 for Sonia! Congratulations. That is just great. Isn't that terrific? All righty. You've done it. Both of you, we're going to split that money. Okay. Now, I'll tell you what we're going to do. You got it right, so you stay up there. Oh, there's the buzzer. Okay, you, scoot right back up there, Kevin. You head over there, Sonia. That buzzer that you heard means this is the end of the show, so this is the last riddle of the week. It's on an automatic jackpot riddle. Alan, stand up. We'll go right to you, and here's a chance for another 640 bucks, Kevin. Wow. <laughs> Here's my riddle. Think of it as your taxes. Okay. <laughs> okay, here we go. Yeah, I'm trying to win yeah. something here. <laughs> your wife doesn't mind if you take me out every night, as long as the neighbors don't get wind of it. Your wife doesn't mind if you take me out every night, as long as the neighbors don't get wind of it for $640. What am I? Uh, got the trash. Trash or garbage? Yes, right. indeed. We'll give that to you. We'll go to the commercial. We'll be right back. Well, Kathy and Jane won some nice prizes today. John, you want to tell them about it? Let's we'll start with Kathy. You've won Hitachi's compact disc changer. Plays 12 compact discs. Independent disc exchange. Free play modes. Built-in timer. Scan and play. Don't stop the music. From Hitachi, a $519 value. And Jane, you want to stay at Murrieta Hot Springs Resort in beautiful Southern California. Enjoy tennis, historic natural mineral water, and European spa services. From Murrieta Hot Springs Resort and Health Spa, a $1,455 value. Uh, congratulations to both of you. I hope you enjoy your prizes. Kevin, our king of the hill, you shared over $15,000, and your return tripper will see you uh, in the weeks to come. And this week, all of our players shared in over $31,000 in cash and prizes. Give yourselves a hand. You're a great group of contestants. Had a great time with you. This is Jeff Edwards. Hoping to see you again right here on Jackpot. Be sure to tune in Monday when somebody is going to stand up and shout. The following supplier of products have furnished them free of charge. Freedom Rent-A-Car System.
Atachi, Murrieta Hot Springs Resort and Health Spa. This week, some of our contestants will be eligible to receive one of these gifts. Ray-Ban Tortuga sunglasses. Classic styling and distinctive fashion with the look of gold or tortoise shell. Plus Ray-Ban glare-beating lenses from Bausch & Lomb. People are experiencing the Freedom Rent-A-Car difference. Freedom features fine Chrysler products, airport locations, quality service, and friendly rates. Make Freedom Rent-A-Car your choice. Plus an authentic reproduction from our past. A pine plant stand finished in weathered white from Broy Hills Millwood Creek Collection. If you live in or plan on visiting the Los Angeles area and would like to be a contestant on Jackpot, call area code 213-461-3721. The following suppliers of products have paid a fee for their promotion on this program. Beecham Products Incorporated, Johnny Cat, Wash and Loam, and Roy Hill Furniture Industries. Booker is working on new beat. And he may be a little out of his element, but that won't stop him from taking his streetwise tactics and shaking up the corporate world. Sunday at 7. Now, it's talk about next on Fox 11.